Giving it all we got Giving it all we can Giving it all Very hot, very sunny. Eh, not really hot, but definitely sunny. At three, eh, two forty in the afternoon, and perfect too because I just took delivery of my new solar lights for the bridge and sala project. Let's take a look. If you remember, if you watched previous video I had those lights and I strung them all the way around and no no so I sent those back I was like nah never mind they just sent me an email today actually say hey we received them but anyway um, at the time I also went back online say when I went online to do the refund I went online to get to get new ones in this box <clears throat> and I decided to go with bigger ones that each have their own individual well, individual light and they're those uh, these ones that are on the edge <clears throat> that you put on the edge this looks like there's a so this is what they are they sit on the edge with the solar panel exposed and then the light is below plastic here is to pull out that that battery connection. Is it battery? Yeah, there's like there's a rechargeable battery in there. The light itself doesn't actually even look that big. But I suppose because of the nature of this it'll hopefully it'll look better. It gives it a little self sticky. And then uh, two screws and some anchors. I won't need those anchors. Might very well put the screws into that <clears throat> wood, but I don't know what I'm gonna do if, with the cement. I only, I, also, I only bought uh, 20 of these, so I don't know. Maybe the bridge, 10 on either side, or if I go five, and then five, then five. I think I bought 20 because that was the limit you could buy at one time with them. And then I'll, so that's what I'll do. I'll, maybe I'll put them on the bridge and if they look cool, I'll buy more and put them around the rest of the sala. Yeah? All right, well, let's take a look. I'm gonna go get my drill. And I got my music speaker box plugged into my solar that I put up yesterday. I've been, I plugged it in this morning. I just letting it blast all day. So, uh, yeah, it hasn't changed. Solar's holding up pretty good. The battery indicates, you know, there's three bars. It's still holding two bars. Uh, but anyway, yeah, I'm gonna lay these out, see, see how, uh, how spaced out they are with 20 of them. First, I gotta unpack them. Unpack them. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Right here by the pond. I'll probably put all my screws and stuff together. They're individually wrapped. Of course. One thing about Thailand, oh, they love their plastic wrap. Or I should say China, really. There's a lot of stuff in Thailand. It's coming from China, like the rest of the world. God bless China. Actually, I don't even know where we'd be. Where, where, where would the world be without China? Dang, man. You know, they say that China, copies 
a lot of the stuff, like coffee stuff from America or whatever. Yeah, I have a feeling that we do a fair amount of copying in America too. Oh, look at this. This is a little bonus. This is a free USB light. USB LED light. They always, that's what I like about Lazada too, is most of these companies, it's, it's not even so much that they want your business as it is, they, they always throw in like a freebie. I mean, that's obviously, it's got to be part of the marketing, marketing, but there's always something free in there for you. Sometimes it's really cool. I got those those tool packs. I got I think I have two or three of them now. Comes with screwdrivers and razor blade, you know, box cutter and and uh, yeah, all kinds of stuff in there. Very cool. Hopefully this will. It probably will. There'll probably be enough sun left today if I can get this done. It's quarter to three now, so three, four, five. Mm, a few hours, a few hours left of, of daylight to absorb the sun. Which you know the panels are, are big enough. I mean it is it is only a small LED light and it does have a, a sizable battery. Although that battery probably wants to charge for eight hours. So, mm. Meh, maybe. I'm probably gonna have to read one, of, at least one of these directions. It might say, it might say, don't pull this. You know, don't pull the plastic thing out for eight hours or something. In which case, I will not be able to turn them on tonight. Or I should say, oh, this one's already out. Somebody. Hopefully I got 20 of them. I know I didn't even count them when I was opening them. But my wife was all, oh, was that again? Well, I got a whole bunch of different stuff coming from Lazada. So let me put these things in here. So it should be saying that every day here. Mm. Yeah. You ever see those, well, you guys watch those YouTube videos where the guys, they don't do any talking at all, they just go about their life and people watch that. Oh. Don't expose the battery to naked flames or high temps. Uh, they're weather resistant, but do not soak, drop them in water or liquid. Don't look in direct, don't look into the lamp when it's on. Don't use the lamp if the chimney is damaged. I don't know what that is. Uh, the light sources are not replaceable. If the lamp stops working, it must be discarded. Aww. Do not attempt to charge batteries with a battery charger that is connected to the mains and do not attempt to run the solar lamp from the mains. Ooh. When replacing the batteries, use only rechargeable ones. Buy the correct size. Remove the battery from the lamp if it's not going to be used. Mark out, drill out, pull out the plastic, fasten the solar. Uh, it says, must have charged the battery in direct sunlight for 24 hours. So shoot, that means it's like three full days or something. That's all right. Well, oh, uh, my legs, man. Let me put these in here. Put them back. Put them back in the box. Wait a minute, though. Does that mean I have to? Well, I can't. I can't charge the battery. Is there an on or off? That thing says, says, before the lamp, 
can shine, oh, before it can shine at full capacity, it charge it for three. Because I was gonna say, wait a minute, in order to charge it, I have to pull out that battery slip, you know, so it connects. <sighs> All right, <clears throat> let's see, let's take a look. See how I'm gonna get laid out there. My camera's gonna fall over. That's 10. Well, I'll put them all here and we'll see. Well, the first thing I see is there's only 18. I could have sworn I bought 20. But I don't know what that means. Maybe maybe when it said you can only buy, because a bubble popped up, you know, and said you can only buy the capacity. Like, but I thought it was 20. I put 20 on there. But we'll see what the price is when I look at it. Uh, although it's hot out there, dude. <laughs> Whoa. So that's what I'm gonna do. I, I got them on both sides. There's nine on both sides, including the one on the end. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then I, on the very top out there, that last rung going on the top, 
I put that out there. So yeah. Hmm. My camera's probably gonna heat up. But hey, man. Let's uh. Let's see what it does. You know. You gotta be careful they they will teeter into the water if I let go of it. It's a little sketchy. Yeah, you guys probably don't need to watch that whole thing. Oh my God, I'm already sweating. I'm only got two of them done. <sighs> All right, well, let's look at it once it's done. Back at you. And, whoo, yeah, blazing hot. But I put them on here. Two, 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 oh, you see that? Two, 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 two. And then two caps right there, one there, one there. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. But turns out that looks like I am missing two sets of screws for these guys. So you know what? I could leave them out here to charge. I don't know, that screw's on there. But I'm missing one set of screws. I'm gonna leave this here like this. Hopefully it won't fall in the water or the cat or my wife kick it in there accidentally but oh boy blazing and like I mentioned I'm missing two uh, lights 
but I'll have to go back into my account and look to see if maybe I paid for 20 and then maybe they back charged only 18 because that's the quantity they had. So we'll see. If not, I just, I just shoot an email, you know, through the Zada. And um, they've always been real good, everybody. So they'll probably correct that and say, oh, we'll send you, we'll send you two more. And they'll probably send me two more and one of them, one more of them little lights. One of them more of them little USB lights. I also took, I took delivery, I think yesterday, of a, uh, of a motor for the sprayer that my wife uses to spray the weeds and all that. And uh, she thought it was her battery, but well, the battery was dead, yeah, I'm sorry. The battery was dead to a doornail, so I swapped it out. It turns out that the casing actually fit one of my bigger, the bigger batteries, the same size I'm using for the solar. It fits that. So, but then when I set it up, it didn't work. I knew it was a motor. So, but those, those, the whole unit or whatever is, you know, plastic box and everything is only like 500 baht, I think. Five or 600 baht. So I paid 120 or something like that for the uh, for the motor, and I put it in there and uh, you know rewired it, and boom, that works good. Although I'm listening and I hear now that my music's not going. What's up? It's got the time. So they're selling one thing on the battery. Shows, uh, what's that? 18, 11.8 volts. Oh, I don't think it's, is that on? It's been going all day, like I said, sir. Oh, you know what? That's right. That's right. See, I set it up this morning, right? And because I did actually, I did find the instructions. So you know, you got to short short press these buttons and then set it up. I'm still not perfect on that because I was a little bit sleepy when I was putting that on there. But I do remember using a value of eight in terms of um, uh, like let it run for eight hours i guess so maybe <clears throat> maybe it turned itself off after eight hours i don't think the battery ran out i think it just turned itself off <sighs> what's my wife doing in here it's easy to find bugs and stuff if there's going to be bugs or anybody trying to attach to the walls or anything like that because everything's really white very bright, very easy to see. Boom, you see that behind me? Nice. Well, whoo, so solar lights, new solar lights, and it's hot, like I said. So uh, even though it said 24 hours of pure sunlight to get its brightest, well, that tells me that, hey man, maybe it's gonna be bright enough tonight in a few hours, because it's what, three now, 320. So that was, I was out here at what, four? I mean, uh, 240. So 35, yeah, 35, 40 minutes worth of work. And then, um, and it's baking now. So 320, 425, 20, eh, two hours worth of sunshine. I don't know how much I'll get out of there, but I have a feeling it might be all right. All right, man, well, stay tuned, I'm gonna, uh, see if I can give you a quick shot of that lit up after a few hours and uh, I'll get back at you from here on the bottom. Ooh. Well, let's see if the lights are lit. Oh, it's kind of, wow, it's pretty cool. Kind of weird looking though. They are they're definitely way brighter than the other ones were but i don't know you can't see it by you can probably see it it's kind of a blue red there's green and i don't know they're different colors but it's 
It's actually all supposed, that one just turned green. It's all supposed to be white. So, I think maybe that one just turned red back. Oh, we'll see. Maybe when, uh, when it's uh, fully charged, like I said, it said, it said it takes 24 hours for it to do the light thing, so, you know, get it. You kind of get the runway thing going there. Not quite. Anyway, 